Welcome to PC Mac. In today's video, I'm going to show you how you can go ahead and install OpenVPN on Mac OS and use a free VPN website to connect to other location over the world. So let's do it. First of all, let's just go ahead and open Safari to download the OpenVPN on the computer. So let me just go ahead and type the website name. So the website is openvpn.net and once you open it, you will see this website in front of you. So what we can do, we need to download the VPN client. And once you select it, it will directly take you to Mac OS download option. It automatically detect your operating system if you're using Mac OS, Windows, Linux or Android. So I have already downloaded and installed it. So it's right here. Once I'll open it. Okay, so it's open. Now you can see I have already connected one profile here. But if we go back, uh, if we go here on these three lines, you can see other options as well and to add a new vpn file what we need to do is we need to connect using this plus sign so once we click on it it will give us two option either we can use a url or a file so in this case we will go ahead and download a file and upload it here and use it so i already have one file that is us1 so i tried the us server so let's try to download other profile and try to connect with them this one is working. So once I'll try to connect with it, it will ask for the password. So we need to visit the website again and get the password from there. So let me just show you. So once I'll try to connect it, it will ask for the password. So what we'll do, we'll go back to the website and then try to download another uh, configuration file for OpenVPN and also try to use the previous one. So we can connect to the previous server as well. So the website name uh, is, let me just open it from the bookmark. So the website is right here, freeopenvpn.org. And uh, I have used the United States server. Let's just go ahead and click on it, get access. And once we do that, a password is already here. A new password is generated. You can see a pin or password. So let's just try to connect here. Let's move it aside and then put the password now. Now let's try to connect. So we just need to download the file once and we need to visit the website again to get the new password. So as you can see, it's working. You can see the bytes are going up and down right here. So let's just go ahead and close this one and try to connect with another server. So let's try the UK one. So get access. Now this is the thing that you need to do and always use the UDP version. So let's click on UDP and it will start downloading. And the username is same for everything free open VPN, but the password will change as you can see to avoid any mistake of our technology by a user. The password for the free VPN server will be changed periodically. So what we'll do, let's try to connect with it and uh, click on the plus sign use the file and browse for the file and this one is uh, the uk one let's click on it open now the username is free open vpn the website as it is free open vpn and now let's try to connect and put the password or you can save the password as well but once it's changed you need to put it again by using the same website so let's just go ahead and click on ok to connect to the uk server uh, it will ask for the pin so let's try one more time so it says authentication failed let me just check one more time what's the problem freeopenvpn.org let's check it free open vpn so let's delete the profile and try to connect it again so it's the uk one open 
2718 I don't know what where is it 7 or 1 so let's just try 7 because I'm trying to put 1 before and try to connect now so it's connected I'm like typing it wrong it's 7 instead of 1 so it's working as you can see uh, let's check the speed as well what's the speed so it's looking for the optimal server and uh, it will start in a moment so you can uh, see that the location is automatically changed I'm in India now let's see what will be the download speed and the upload speed so I believe it's uh, like something is blocking this internet test let's try on a different web browser I'm using Safari instead of that let's try Google Chrome so it's working absolutely fine but because of some unusual region the speed test is not working but let me just show you my speed by just turning it down and then open it now you can see uh, the server automatically get changed to excitel that's my service provider and we have saved the password so let's try to connect it one more time if it's working or not so this got connected so if it's not connected then you need to visit the website again to get a new password and connect it again with the server so uh, this is the part one of this video in the next video i'll show you a different website and we'll try different location to connect to the vpn server that is totally free and easy to use easy to work if you face any issue with this tutorial you can write me down in the comment section i'll try to answer your questions and if you like my work please hit the like button subscribe to my channel press the bell notification for my latest videos thank you for watching bye bye take care have a nice day